forcedhomes.com. Uh, today I want to talk to you a little about showing and showing traffic and what kind of an indicator that might be as to where the market is and where it's been. So uh, let's, let's look at the uh, statistics. As I went through the numbers this morning for a client, a couple of things came up. Uh, fact is, when you look at Triangle Y, the Triangle MLS, uh, you realize that we're up 10% in number of showings January of 2012 to January 2011. Um, do you, most of us would agree, right, that 2004 was a pretty robust market on the verge of actually breaking out and having the best real estate times we've ever had. We were actually up 16% number of showings January of 2012 over January of 2004. Um, we were even with the years 2005, 2009, and 2010. The uh, market-wide, the price point that, that got the most showings was between 200000 and 300000 And it was almost by a two-to-one margin. And, you know, when you look at the average price point of sales, the average sale price in Wake County for a detached home was $195,000. Tells me that those homes that are listed in the low 200000s should be getting a lot of showings and should be selling in a fairly quick amount of time. We've been in what most people would uh, describe as a buyer's market for some time. I think we're in a, into a phase now where things are starting to level out a little bit, especially here in Wake Forest. And let me share with you why I think that. Fact is, January of 2011, we had 987 homes on the market in Wake Forest. January of this year, 697. That's a 29% decrease in the number of available homes on the market. At that exact same time, we were up in the number of showings by 2%. So a third less available homes. Still the same amount of showings, actually a little increase in showings. That two hundred dollars to $300,000 price point we spoke of a few minutes ago uh, in Wake Forest, there's actually 34% less of those homes on our market right now, available in our market right now. However, again, showings are up about 2%. The number of showings in Wake Forest, however, between one hundred and fifty and 200000 up 45% number of showings year over year. Now, those are the good numbers. What, what's the opposite side of that? Well, that's why we have averages, right? When you look at homes above 300,000, nearly every price point above 300,000 is down in number of showings. However, sales are actually up. And so, you know, you can make these numbers and you can bend them any way you want to. I think the showings are actually a, a very strong indicator of where the market is as compared to current inventory. And finally, let me leave you with this. Do you realize that the number, th the, the, when you look at number of showings per neighborhood, Heritage Wake Forest ranks as number three in the entire Triangle MLS as far as number of showings for January. Number one was Wakefield, which is just outside of the Wake Forest market. And as most of us know, those that live in Wakefield live, eat, and breathe out of Wake Forest. That's my current update. That's what's going on in the market. If you have any questions or you need to buy or sell a home in the Wake Forest area, give us a call. Visit us on the web, wakeforesthomes.com. Thanks again.